Hi, welcome if you're watching live. If you're watching on the replay, uh, please skip five minutes in advance. Um, just because I want to give everyone a chance to show up and I want to say hi to everyone. Sorry about that. So, um, they're adding the doors. I don't know if you were here yesterday, but you saw that they were putting concrete down on the house. And because our house had like two levels down. And so on the two levels down, they had a door, but we don't want those two steps. So we filled it in with concrete. And so now the door is too low. So they're gonna, they, they're drilling like more in the drywall and the house, and they're gonna fill in this space and bring up the door. So, and that's, uh, that's kind of what, what's happening right now. And then Kit Kat is scared, so. <laughs> She's hiding right there. Hi, Liti. Hi, Tricia. Hi, Peg. How are y'all? Is Kristen here? Let's drop. Let's drop some foxes for Kristen. Some cupcakes for Tricia. And some black hearts for Kiara. Let's tune. Good pants morning, everybody. Hi. I know it's bad. I'm sorry. And I think for Sayada, of course, the emoji is going to be the bird. That is so bad. If it's really annoying, we'll end the live stream. Profit here, the bikinis. Let's drop those bikinis. And yes, I gotta get the birdie. How loud it is. Yes, but not so. I mean, yeah, they're kind of intermittent with it. I'm looking for my microphone. So that's what happens with moving. Everything moves. It's good. Okay. Well, let's just, uh, I hope it stopped for good. No, there it is. All right, we're just going to speak up. <laughs> you can bring your headphone down, headphone level down. Let's give some likes. Lots of likes will stop the sound. <laughs> this is real life. All right, so today we're working on line two. We're not even looking back. Line two. So give me an F for beat one. F for beat one. Add the pinky for beat two. Move the pinky to the third fret for beat three. Back to five. Three, big brain idea. <laughs> and lift the pinky completely. And thank you, Mani. I just got my baby's blanket, so. I like to put the blankets down so she can um, start learning how to crawl she's trying let me give Kit Kat another place to rest she really likes being inside gig bags there you go there you go no you don't want the gig bag there you go it's for you <laughs> I got a rug so hopefully the echo will go away once there's no construction going on okay 
So line two, we got B1. It's just an F, but I want that pinky to be stretched as far as you can. And then you add the fifth, move the pinky to the third, pinky back to fifth, back to the third, and lift the pinky off. What you're doing with the melody is zero, five, three, five, three, zero. Want to do the line? Birds singing in the sycamore tree. Oh, thank you. I find it helpful to put the ring finger on the third while doing the five one two zero. Oh. Ah, love it, Shelly. So Shelly is using the ring finger on fret three. That way, when you do five, you can just lift off and the ring finger is already in position for three. Thank you, that's helpful. So, no ring finger. Put down the pinky and the ring finger is already in position. Lift the pinky off. Pinky again. Lift the pinky off. And O. Oh. Shelly power. Oh, I like the brain for Shelly. That's a good one. And then Peg, we need to choose one for Peg. Peg, you need to tell us a little bit more about you so we can kind of start getting a good emoji there. So again. <laughs> We're at 60 likes. Let's turn this into 70 likes, please. Peg, that's cute. Kristen, you're good at this emoji choosing. I like that. I would want the most random emoji for me. I don't know, like the genie or something. Muy difícil. Okay. Vamos con nada más fa. En Argentina usan fa o usan F. Sé que me entiendes F, pero me, me da curiosidad saber. Okay, so you've got F or fa. But I want this pinky to be all the way down. Oh, I like the emoji with the mustache and the eyebrows. That's a good one. And then, okay. Entonces, en fa, vas a tener el, el meñique acá listo para el quinto. Okay? Pero no lo vas a aplastar y quieres también tener el anular listo para el tercero. Entonces, vas a hacer fa en, en one. Y vas a bajar los dos, you're going to lower both of them, when you do five. Vas a subir el, el meñique, you're going to lift the pinky. Y vas a bajar el meñique, you're going to bring the pinky back down and only pick A string. And then, otra vez, fa con do. F plus C, and then lift all the fingers, open A. Okay, let me give you a cheat. And Prof is here, he will tell me if he approves of the cheat. You're gonna do an F, let it ring, don't touch the strings. So you're gonna just strum and five, three, five, three, oh. So strum, five, three, five, three, oh. So strum and just 
the A string. That's an absolute cheat. And by the way, all the new people, hi, welcome. There's a free printable down below. Um, yes, the cheat is given by your friend, Bernadette, not your teacher. Your teacher, Bernadette, says, stretch your pinky, you can do it. Your friend says, ah, cheat. Um, I guess you could do... When you do the three, you can do the full. On the threes, that's another one. But, and see, because I'd rather you um, stay here and play than quit. Do you know what I'm saying? I need a longer pinky or a shorter uke or a shorter uke. Your pinky is perfect, Marta. Okay, you got it? Okay, sweet. Let's leave that on the parking lot and move to F minor. Now you see X, five, four, five. X means don't touch that string. It should be muted. You can mute by putting the thumb over here. I never say that. But you don't want it to ring. Or you, <laughs> you could um, assign uh, fingers for each string and just uh, pick on those. Or you can strum down carefully, making sure not to press G string. And you want, oh, there we go. There we go, I was on the wrong one. Yeah, that would be it. You're gonna do that first. This one, kind of like a G7, but move it up to the fifth and fourth frets. Hi, Manuel, welcome. And then switch to a staircase position, five, four, three. And then two and three and four. So again, let's go super slow. One and two and three and four go one and two and three and four i like to put i like this i like this recommendation i like to put fingers in three four five and then add the pinky for the five let me just lift and i'm there i love that one thank you so you can put your three four five and pivot the hand upwards to make that pinky fit on A string on the fifth. So then you can do that down B and lift the pinky. And then two and three and four. I love that one. I'm gonna do that one too. Let me see. Noisy feet. Thank you for that recommendation, noisy feet. Let's drop some feet in the chat for noisy feet. That was really good. And then you can lift everything off for the downbeat of the third bar, C. And you can do everything. All strings can ring. I like all the feet and the paws, so cute. Oh, I love it. You guys are so cute. Okay, so let's go to the next fret and let's figure out how we're gonna play we are on the second line, Amy. And now we're gonna go to the third bar of the second line where there's a C chord. So we have a C chord, pick on E string, pick on A string, five, and then six, three, three. How are we gonna do that, six, three, three? I think I'm gonna do it this way, pinky, and then middle index. Oh, the paws are cute. Our baby bar. Baby bar works really well there. Thank you, Linda. And then five, one, two. Wah! Five, one, two. 
And the ring finger is ready for the three. <laughs> Profe, you are working us out. And by the way, we can definitely hit 100 likes right now. I think we can do it. Let's try, let's try, let's try. Thank you to everyone who already hit the like button. It really helps the videos perform well. Um, I need an extra pinky, right? I need like a middle finger shaped pinky right here. <laughs> okay, so that far, let's take it one beat at a time. We got one and two, oh no, 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 just picking. Ready, go. One and two and three and four and I thought I saw a mosquito. Can you play G augmented again so I can make sure I'm playing it right? Yeah, there's a mosquito. Um, G augmented, six, three, three. So <clears throat> you can do a baby bar of those with the pinky. And then, hi Steve, I was wondering if you still made these. Using index on second string and middle on third, so I can move easier. So, I think I'm doing that way as well. You can use index on C string, E, uh, e string with middle, pinky with A. Or you can do a baby bar. Now, if you're doing this, we still have to move to a one, two, and bring the pinky up one fret. Does anybody have a trick for the G7? Yeah, I'd like to see a trick for that one. And woo, we're at 96 likes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, again, one and two. Oh, Faye, I didn't see what you wrote. Sorry, Faye, I don't mean to ignore anybody. It's just that I can only see like two or three comments at a time. And if I'm looking down at the music, I miss the comments. I'm sorry if you felt ignored. I did not mean to ignore you. Okay, so let's do third bar of the second line. One and two and three and four. Go. One and two and three and four and wow i was all over the place with that one do not feel bad if you messed up i messed up like crazy hmm okay again one and two and three and four go one Two and three and four and the second line that measure fade. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Baby bar line two. Baby bar is what we're working on. The baby bar makes the transition more complicated. It made it more complicated for me. So I'm just I'm using um <coughs> two two. Let's try again. One and two. Hi, Lauren. And three and four. Go. One and two and three and four and. I think it's possible. Hi, Sandra. Welcome. We are using the printable that's in the link down below. And we're on the second line. <laughs> Third fret. The stream is stopping for you. I'm sorry. I, as far as I know, it's okay. Let's try again. One and oh, do it up close. Yes. Thank you, Suzanne. Glad it's doable. I was getting a little scared. One and two and three and four. And one, and two, and three, 
and four and Ready? Did it? Yay! Thank you. Okay, again. Ready? Go. One and two and three and four and again. Ready? One, two. Ready? Go. One and two and three and four and and let's do the last bar of this line just for fun ready go one and two and three and four again ready go one and two and three and four and Karen thank you for asking me to do it up close wow some days are just a little more challenging huh especially with the sound I'm sorry but thank you so much for being here in spite of the sound I really 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 appreciate it okay so let's try those last two bars I like the last bar <laughs> Marta you are like me here we go the fourth the third and fourth bars of second line one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and ah i forgot to keep going again ready go one and two and three and four and one and two and three hi Daria and four the last bar looks almost like a joke Rohe put in to mess with our hearts yes okay let's look at line three let's go to something a little bit easier hi Sandra line three we got an A on beat one yes Beat two, yes. And of two. Beat three. And nothing on beat four. And so we've got this shape. Look up real quick. We've got the A and then the A6. <laughs> okay, here we go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and okay again ready one two ready thank you prof go one and two and three and four Oh, not bad, right? Let's do it again. One and two and three and four. Go. One and two and three and four and. Uh, A6 sounds so lovely. I didn't know that. And did we reach 100 likes? I still see 99. Madeline says, like this one. All right, good, because I don't know if you're going to like the next one. Maybe. Next bar. We're on the chorus. Second bar. B minor. You can bar the whole thing. Or you can do a finger on each one. We got B. I think this is easier for me. One. And two. And then E7. Three. And four. Not bad, right? I missed the timing on the four and. I'll say rest. I'll say rest. So that B minor, ready? Go. One, hi Tom. Two, and three, and four. Yay, again, one, and two, and three, and four. Go, one, and two, and three, and four. Go to the next one, one, and Okay, 
that whole line is the repetition of bars one and two. So you do bar one and two, and then again, bar one and two. Hi, Jenny. Here we go. Bar. Let's do the whole line. One and two and three. One plus two is three. One and two and three and go and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and rest and one and two and three and four. Did you hear? Is it Siri? I don't know why Siri just started telling me what one more is <laughs> Siri said that a one plus two is three. <laughs> Today's the weirdest live stream, but you know what? That's, that's the thing with going live. Just like the weirdest things happen. So yeah, that's Siri. She, Siri gets the nerd emoji, cause <laughs> really one plus two is three. I guess children can now use Siri to do their math homework. That's interesting. Nolan, what is up? Everybody, Nolan is an incredible musician, artist, extraordinaire. <gasps> Nolan, I wanna do a ukulele concert online. Will you perform? I'd love to have you. All right, let's do line three. One and two and three and four. Go. One and two and three and rest. And one and two and three and four. And one and two and one and two and one and two. And and three and four. My bad on the counting. Uh, my Google's in the kitchen, my TV will say something and hey Google will answer. That is weird technology like talking to each other. Ugh. All right, one last time that third line. One and two, you got this, go. Trying to sing it. Next bar. And two and three and four. And one and two and three and four. I'm like we think. I keep messing up that four, that beat four. So let's do it again for me. One and two and ready, smile. Go now. One and two and three and rest. And one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and um, let's do line one and two of the chorus. We can do it. Line one and line two of the chorus. Here we go. Line one and two. And thank you, Kiara. One and two and ready. Chorus. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. something new. You're gonna jump. Zero, three, four, three. What dissonance? One and two and then 
go to normal G7. Three and four. <clears throat> Again, ready? Go. One and two and three and four. One and two and three and four. Again. One and two, slide. It's a bit fast. I'll go slower. I'll go slower. Thank you. One and two slide. And then slide again. Because you have a, a three, right? No, no, no. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You fixed it for me. One and two and three and four. <laughs> G shape. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Bye, Mati. Take care. Thank you. I was off. One. I'll say that cheesy thing that teachers always say when they mess up. I was testing you to see if you were listening. <laughs> One. Wait, wouldn't G sharp major seven have this? Oh, but it's major seven. Cause it's got a G in there. So one and two and three and four. I think, bye Mati, take care. I'm sleeping in the class, man. <laughs> the G is the major seven. Okay, got it, thank you. Sweet. Um, Let's do Line two of the chorus. Line two of the chorus. One and two and three and four. And 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 one and two and three. And four. Oh man, I messed up. All right. <clears throat> we need an emoji for Mati. Mati is the one that says Maria Matilde. Mati's from Argentina. But let's not do the Argentina flag. That's too obvious. It has to be something, something else, something cool, something fun. Okay, I messed up that line. Uh, let's go from the bar right before. So third bar of the second line of the chorus, where it says A and then A6. One, two at the A, ready, go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. I think I got it. Let me know if you got it. Again, ready from the A. Go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. shining We're going to get it, you guys. We are going to do this. Okay, so Mati, you got it, Steve? Yay! Mati is feeling mountains. Somebody else commented the mermaid. The mermaid's cute. Phew, got it that time. Okay, sweet. Let's do the chorus then. Y'all are ready. I'm not ready, but y'all are ready for the chorus. So let's do the chorus. One and two and three and chorus. Go one and two and three and four and one, two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. Next line, go one and two and three, breathe and four and one and two. 
And then we would go to the verse. So makes sense. It does make sense. You're right. Um, tomorrow I can't do this lesson because I have a doctor's appointment. So let's meet Thursday, Wednesday and Thursday. Let's do Wednesday and Thursday because I can't do no tomorrow's Wednesday. What day is it today? Let's do Thursday and Friday. Thursday and Friday. Um. I feel like we have the whole song. We just are not like smooth through it yesterday yet. Okay, Thursday and Friday. Yes, let's do Thursday and Friday to make up for not being able to do tomorrow. I just have a doctor's appointment. And they said, uh, all we have is 9.45. I need to do this much more slowly. Is there an audio for the song? Ah, yes, profe. Profe, which email did you send them to? I have like 15 email addresses because Gmail kept telling me I had a full inbox. And uh, I will upload them right now. Profe, te acuerdas al PM? Sebastian? Let me see. We transfer Asi. Is we transfer? I'm trying to post these now. Okay, um, I will find them in my inbox. Ah, I, I see them now. <laughs> Be careful with this message. Sebastian Pavon has never sent you messages using this email address. Ah, it thinks you're spam. Okay, so SoundCloud. For anybody who's new here, we have a SoundCloud where I upload all of our play along audios. Use these play along audios to listen to as you get ready, as you drive, brush your teeth, anything, or as you practice, of course, as you practice, because they, hi, thank you, DMG. My bus is arriving in Sofia and I will have to get off. Have a great stream, everybody. Oh, thank you. Let's drop some orange hearts. So, um, in, in the SoundCloud, you have that available for you to practice with. So please use that. It's a really great resource. Um, I will upload these now so that you'll have them available. <laughs> I was doubting my own memory. No, no, you're good, you're good. files to upload and oh dream a little dream of me uploading now I have a broken arm <laughs> I'm sorry about your broken arm 
but it's good to continue practicing watching. Okay, so I'm uploading. I have the really cute little thumbnail I made for it that my the YouTube thumbnails, but it's on my phone, so I'm gonna need to disconnect uh, to add that to it. But you'll see it right now. Um, actually, I'll just add it. Uh, what is it called? Dream. Dream a little. Dream of me. Chord melody. Practice. Rock. Okay. Okay, you should see it on the SoundCloud now. Sweet. So check it out. Stop practicing, listening. It's going to help a lot. And then tomorrow, take the day off. And we'll meet again the day after tomorrow. I'm sorry about the scheduling conflict. Let me show you how the living room is looking since you got to hear it this whole time. And let me show you Kit Kat because she is so cute. She's a little raccoon. Okay. They look amazing. But tomorrow we will do Hotel California, by the way. I'll be back by then. Yes, we're having our Patreon lesson tomorrow. Wow, it's so precise. And then that other one is for my bedroom so that they'll all match. Yes, they made the new doors higher to make up for the higher floor. It looks awesome. Okay, wait a minute. So, let me show you the view from over here. I'm glad you all are enjoying seeing this space come together. It's It takes, like, a lot of patience. How are really you from be? Let's see how baby's doing. She's asleep. She's asleep. Poor thing. How is she going to sleep through this? So they're going to take these two. And then they made the steps you saw yesterday. Yeah, there's so many doors. Yeah, so they added those steps because that's how much the sinking room came up. So the door used to be at the bottom. There was no step at all. But the steps look so good, right? It is a lot of work and it is so expensive. But, I mean, we had one accident already with the baby on the step, and we don't, we don't want to have another, so, like, a step indoors, just coming down. I, I tripped going upwards when I was pregnant. I tripped, I was, like, really pregnant. I was, like, eight months pregnant, and I tripped going up. Thankfully, I did not land on my belly, 
And then Wilhelm had an accident while he was holding the baby, so. What a beautiful home. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. I mean, it definitely has its pros and cons. I love the house. Like, the house is perfect, and I'm so happy. But we're far from, like, civilization, so. Um, when my mom comes to watch the baby, she'll bring us the things we need. So, that's just the, the trade-off. But it is very bright and sunny. I love that. And it's very quiet to sleep in at night. So I love that too. Alrighty, fam. Well, I'm going to go work on getting the really nice cover for the audio tracks. And then I didn't finish editing the tutorial I was trying to post yesterday. I can't imagine sitting those steps playing you. Yeah, it's going to be really fun uh, having the Yuke family over and playing and everything. I don't know who's going to be our first guest, if it's going to be Ricky or Abby. We'll see. Um, it's outside of El Centro, but technically our zip code is still El Centro. Because, like, El Centro has a lot of remote, like, homes, there's a lot of people that live the way that we do. Like, little ranch homes. Jaime wants goats. I don't want goats. They, like, like hit people, so... Yeah. Alpacas. Yeah, alpacas sound fun. And bye, Manuel. Take care. And thank you, everyone, for hanging out. Uh, again, take the day off tomorrow. We will reconvene on Thursday and Friday. Uh, and thank you. I'll be chatting on Telegram. We have a Telegram chat if you would like to join us. The link is down below. Security codes um do it for the meme i don't know i feel i've always wanted like donkeys like uh dwarf is that what they're called dwarf donkeys or baby donkeys are you getting a dog um i'd like to get a few dogs so next project is to save money and then put up some fence and get some dogs bye daria so i really like uh the look of doberman dogs so a coat for the goats. So I'm thinking about Dobermans. We'll see though. And thank you, Thelma. I'm glad that you found it fun even through the noise. I can just see you out milking a goat. Cat friendly dogs. I think like as long as we get them when they're puppies, they'll be friends to the cats. But I, I do love the idea of rescuing an animal, but... I've got the cats, I've got the baby, so I really do need to... Oh, you guys, look at how close to the edge it is up there. You see that? So close to the slant. Wow. Yeah, because I have the baby and I have the kitties, like, I've got to get a puppy. One that's going to get used to... Our family. If it were just him and I, of course, I'd get all the rescues in the world. I love the idea of an older dog. I feel like they're so mature and wise, and rescues just have this like kindness to them. You know, I think it's because they're grateful. But um, I can't risk it. The lesson finished, and the noise stopped. That's so typical, right? Now it's like we could have had our lesson. But I want to change the time because I know some of you, it's like really late at night. Are they knocking for me? They're just tapping. Labradors. I thought about Labradors too. I just don't know if they're too nice to strangers. I want an intimidating looking dog. And like... We're changing all the codes and we're getting like camera system. So everything, Labradors, they're incredibly smart. Yeah, I've had labs my whole life, but I don't want it to be nice to strangers. A goat farmer told me if you like hinge to go smoothly, don't get goats. Yeah, I don't want goats. Jaime likes goats, but I'm not trying to get head butted in the butt. <laughs> Shepherd. They are too nice to everyone. See, yeah, I, I also thought about German Shepherds, but German Shepherds have those bad hips, you know? 
<laughs> Maybe the goat can protect you. Um, I've thought about getting geese. Mastiffs are huge family dogs, but don't like strangers. The mastiffs are cool. If I if like I knew that a Labrador would be a good guard dog, I'd be down with labs. And yeah, not too. too that's the thing, cause I I'm just a big bay retriever, very loyal, very protective. I love those mastiffs. Drool too much. Geese are aggressive. See, I want like something that's aggressive to strangers. <laughs> Fluffy border collie. It, it's really exciting to think about a dog for the family. I think once the baby is like a year at least, a year old, because so much of my time still goes to the baby. And I would love to really spend a, a great amount of time with the dog too, you know, not neglect the dog and just. My bird is super aggressive to strangers. Colorado has Canadian geese and they're mean. Yeah, I want something that's gonna be mean to strangers. No, but I don't think this climate is good for geese. It's so hot over here. Bye, Madeline. She had your Labrador stopped a uh, robbery. Was it a black lab, yellow lab? They get a badger. <laughs> Badger emoji. Oh, that's the best comment ever. Get a badger. Okay, so there's a golden video on the internet, but I have to warn you, it does have some foul lang language. It what is it called, Steve? The honey badger one. Oh my goodness, there is a badger emoji. Um, oh, the honey badger. It's probably called the Honey Badger Dub. I'm warning you, though, it has foul language. Okay, so look up the Honey Badger Dub. And this guy did, like, a really high-pitched voice and did a dub over, like, you know, like Discovery Channel Animal Planet footage of the Honey Badger. And it is the funniest video ever like i watched it back in college and i started calling all my sassy friends honey badgers get a mule border collies we'll see i also want to see what's like available for adoption as a puppy so yeah that that'll probably make it make it onto one of the vlogs Alrighty, y'all. I'm gonna go get to work on YouTube stuffs, and I'll get back to you all later. Thank you so much for everything. I hope that you had fun at today's lesson, even though it was so loud. Thank you, Profe, for the arrangement, and thank you, Mods, for keeping the chat safe, friendly, and fun and focused. I love you all. I love all your pants. Make sure to wear them. Thank you, Steve. And uh, I'll see you in two days. So now tomorrow in two days. Take care. Adios. Ciao, ciao.